She didn't pay my mortgage payments. She didn't pay uh, gas bills, water bills. Video of the San Diego senior is going viral after he says he became a victim of financial elder abuse. He says the person who stole from him is a family member and that she put him in jeopardy of losing his home. Now strangers are stepping in to help. As ABC 10 News reporter Nate Holmes found out, this grandfather says he never thought he would find himself in this situation. This is 77-year-old Alvin Fulcher, a Navy veteran and longtime San Diego resident. I had the chance to sit down with him. He says because of his health issues, he relied on a family member and their significant other, both whom lived in the home, to help take care of his monthly bills. But he says he never expected that he will be left with thousands of dollars in debt and possibly without a place to live. To do that to me was just hot. Just broke my heart. Alvin Fulcher says he purchased this San Diego home just before he retired from the Navy almost 30 years ago. He says he relied on a family member and their significant other, both who lived in the home, to help take care of his monthly bills after health issues left him blind two years ago. She was hiding uh, mail from me because I can't see. Fulcher says he was clueless about his finances until they went to make plans to bury his late wife last month. After that, the family found a lot of other unpaid bills and strange activity. A lot of charges that weren't authorized, credit cards were taken out in my name. She was transferring money out of my account to his. And the biggest bill, an almost $30,000 mortgage statement that hadn't been paid since last May. Okay, Papa, you want to introduce yourself? Fulcher's grandchildren posted this video to social media, the video catching the eye of thousands. A GoFundMe was created. Community members donated more than the amount Fulcher needs to keep his home. I didn't expect them to, 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 to do this for me. So I am very, very grateful. District Attorney Summer Steffen says although she can't comment on this case, there has been an increase in elder abuse in the county. Her office had 150 felony economic elder abuse cases in the last two years. We had 1,700 victims in one year in 2022, uh, seniors losing money at the tune of $49 million dollars just in San Diego alone. The DA says it's not uncommon for a family member to commit these crimes. The senior is relying on this family member. There's a trust, there's a love. And as for Fulcher and his family member. Don't want to have anything else to do with her, to be honest with you. I really don't. The veteran says the family member and their significant other are no longer living in the home. Fulcher filed a police report on April 25th, but at last check, the DA says the case has not made it to her office yet. Nate Holmes, ABC 10 News.